Pruitt has expressed skepticism about the consensus of climate scientists that man-made carbon emissions are the primary cause of global warming. He also overruled experts that had recommended pulling a top-selling pesticide from the market after peer-reviewed studies showed it damaged children's brains. Pruitt said he will name new leadership and members to three key EPA advisory boards soon the Science Advisory Board, Clean Air Scientific Advisory Committee, and the Board of Scientific Counselors. The five-page policy Pruitt issued Tuesday makes no mention of other potential conflicts of interest, such as accepting research funding from corporate interests regulated by EPA. Current board chairwoman Deborah Swachhammer said the members were already required to follow rules intended to prevent conflicts of interests. It obviously stacks the deck against scientists who do not represent corporate special interests, said Swachhammer, a retired professor who taught environmental health sciences at the University of Minnesota. It speaks volumes that people funded by special interests are okay to be advisors, but not those who have received federal grants. Environmentalists worried that Pruitt will now select board members with financial ties to the fossil fuel and chemical industries. Related video, watch news, TV, and more on News Pulse View. Follow Associated Press environmental writer Michael Biesecker at